Hi everyone, um, today I'm just going to make a very quick video because um, I'm about to load the film on one of my cameras so I might as well show this to you. This, okay. <laughs> this is a Yashica A TLR. It's one of the simpler um, TLR models that Yashica A has produced. Uh, what I have is the white one but it actually looks gray in person but when you take a picture it actually looks an off-white but it's actually gray um, so the way you open it is I'm just gonna show you the features um, this one only has four shutter speeds between 25 to 300 I don't know if you could see it uh, and then I have seven aperture starting from 3.5 right here so the way you set the shutter speed is you just turn this knob right here. Oh, you turn this knob right here, and then this is where, um, like the pointer right here is the one that you use to change the aperture. There you go. And then um, this is the shutter button. So before you take a picture, this is what you do. So you pull this down, and then you click. There you go. Uh, on this side right here, this is what you use to focus, and this is the film advance knob. So focusing, film film advance. At the back, this is like, your film counter, which you can actually close. Okay. And then on the other side, this is what you use to when you need to load the film, which I will show you later. I'm not really going to load the film. But I'm just going to show you how it works. And then to pop, to pop this thing up, you just do it like this. So you can see this is where you can focus and look down. Um, so I'm just going to see. There you go. And you can see right here, there's the Y Yashica logo. You can actually press the whole square thing. And that will actually um, activate or pop out the magnifying glass if you need it. Okay. And then the way it closes, you just press it like that. And to load the film at the bottom, make sure you go to the open, turn it towards the open arrow, and then it opens up the film canister. And this one only uses 120 film, and you actually get reminded of that right here. <coughs> and the knobs right here on the side is the one that you use to um, insert the plastic um spool um to load the film so this is where you load um the new film and then this is where you feed it so when you add film advance it just turns around like that so yeah so that's basically it um i'll i'll post some pictures at the end of this video just so you could see how sharp this is this is like amazing although Unfortunately, I haven't even used this film to do black and white photos. I've only used it for colored negatives and colored slides. So I can't wait to use black and white. But unfortunately, since I actually, I'm actually transferring a film from my Zayana. So this is still a colored negative. So I'm going to use this first. Use this one up first and then I'll load the black and white. So yeah, that's basically, that's my video for the week. I've been away for a week. So um i hope you guys enjoy thanks bye